I received an email this weekend from a young man from Virginia. He wanted to share with me a video that he found on a subject that I have been spending some time on, and that is how the medical field is going to change and how we are going to be, and, and a lot of this is going to be as a result of um, the coronavirus, we're going to have to be able to prove on our, on our cell phones that we're healthy to gain access to airplanes, to gain access to cruise ships, restaurants. And the technology is there. It's just putting it together and putting it on our phone. And he wanted to, and, uh, to share with me a video that he found from a company by the name of Q. And uh, I want you to watch this video. It's about a two-minute video. But while you're watching it, look down in the what would be, I guess, the, the lower left-hand corner and see when the video was actually produced and first distributed. What if you could hold the power of your health in your hands? You could recover from injuries faster, elevate your mood, and keep your immune system and bones strong by balancing your body. The future of your health is now with Q. With a tiny sample, Q gives you access to more information about your body than has ever been available outside of a lab. Giving you the control to reach peak fitness for your body and your mind. Q gives you the power to see how what you do and what you eat affects your body at the deepest level, the molecular level. Q will make recommendations based on your body, your health, and your schedule. It's simple. Insert your cartridge, take your sample, and get results on your phone in just minutes. Q knows the food that will help you recover fast and protect your heart for the long run, helping you become your healthiest and strongest self. Q gives you the information you need when you need it so that you can take care of the ones you love and have more informed conversations with your doctor. I'll send the prescription over to the pharmacist near your hospital. Yes, yes, that's perfect. And alert others in your community so that you can act quickly. your health into your hands, allowing you to make the best choices for the ones you love, your health, your life, and your future. This is Q. I hope you saw that that video was made in 2014. That means that this company probably has been working on this uh, for not just six years, but probably eight to ten years. So this has been in the making, and it is a part of our lives and will be a part of our lives. What I also want to share is that I think it's wonderful that what I'm wanting to do with this channel is actually happening, and that is, it's not a channel all about me, but it's all about you, and that many of you have come to bestofusinvestors.com and registered, and we've become a tribe, and we're sharing our information, and we're, what's really exciting to me is we're drawing in uh, young men like uh, Brandon, who is t 22 years old, he's from Virginia, he's a college student, he's an electrical engineer major, and his goal is to gain financial freedom. And you and I, as a part of Best of Us Investors, are helping him achieve that. And that's warm. That, that, is, that, is, that is just fantastic. So, Become a, if this is new to you, become a part of your, our tribe. Brandon caused me then to dig a little deeper. 
and say, okay, if this was down in 2014, what's happened since then? And I found that Qualcomm recently ran a $10 million contest for people to take medicine to the new frontier. Now, if that sounds a little familiar to you, that's from Star Trek. And Qualcomm has asked them each to develop what is called a tricorder. Now, if you aren't familiar with Star Trek, in Star Trek, um, Dr. Spock and Captain Kirk, if anybody got injured or had some problem, took a little device and ran it over their he hand or their head. And this device then, through the Star Trek computer, would tell them what exactly was wrong with the individual and what treatment needed to be done. And so what their Qualcomm is looking for is taking the sick industry and turn it, the sick care industry, and turning it into a health care industry. And so rather than be reactive to a situation, to be proactive, and that's what the Q thing was all about as well. And I want to share with you a little bit of a video um, from the people who won the contest. I think it's Basil Technologies, and see where they're going with this. So the video we showed you first uh, was 2014 by Brandon that shared with us. This is one that is more in the range of 2019 and where this is all going. Qualcomm Tricorder X Prize really was set up to find a way to provide anyone with the ability to diagnose diseases. A lot of diagnostics today are very siloed. It might be a thermometer or a blood pressure device or a lab test. Um, but now in our exponential age, our age of digital and connected and mobile health, what if we could connect those together and put those in the hands of each of us, the consumer, the patient, to make healthcare smarter, more actionable, and more proactive. The era of just putting blind trust in the medical profession is over, and that's a great thing. Working in the ER is, is, is what I do. The majority of patients really are just looking for a diagnosis, looking for medical advice, people that don't have anywhere else to turn. If they had this at home, I mean, it, it would help 90% uh, of the cases that come to the emergency room. The tricorder that we're developing for this competition, it, it's more advanced than the tricorder from the Star Trek series. He has a vision for where this is going, um, and that really gives us the energy to get this to the end. Well, working in the ER, it's been critical in developing this device. We have to get to a diagnosis quickly. And we broke down that process of, of all the diagnostic steps we took that apart and we coded it and that's the brain of our system it's really the art and science of medicine mingling together this tricorder coming from science fiction into reality is amazing this is the wave of the future there's going to be tons of these kind of devices on now as an investor you're not going to be able to invest in basal technologies basal Basil Leaf Technologies, because it's, it's a family business. It's a, a small company. Somebody will, I'm quite sure, um, purchase them and absorb them and take their technology and add more to it. It was interesting to me. I, I, inter I recently, in this research, found a quote by Tim Cook, the CEO of Apple, and he was asked, what is the biggest contribution that Apple will make in the in the coming future and his answer was healthcare and that goes along with Apple has a new watch that will actually uh, administer a ECG scan which is a scan of your heart and I've seen cases where it has actually saved people's lives and it's only been out I think less than a year so this is where it's going and what, what again excites me is where this is going, where Best of Us Investors is going. And I want you to go register at bestofusinvestors.com uh, best so that you can become a part of this tribe, so that you can contribute to helping Brandon um, grow his 
dream of fan financial independence. You And I want to thank those of you. I did a, a video just this weekend on where should some young person invest. In fact, it was they, they said it was he and a girlfriend, and they had, if I remember right, $10,000 to invest. And I kind of guided them towards ETFs. And, and you all really responded in the comments and wrote paragraphs of guidance to, to this individual. And again, that's what I want this channel to be. I don't want it to be just me, a talking head, which I am. But eventually, I want to get you involved, and we, and we do some Zoom, um, and we do some, some videos where you add your input, and we help 20, 23-year-old, 30-year-olds grow their financial independence. That's the objective of this channel. Again, with this advancement in medical technology, which is going to enable our phones to gain us access to airplanes, cruise ships, restaurants, movie theaters, and the Super Bowl, we need to recognize what's going to be driving that and where we should invest. And what's going to be driving it, number one, is artificial intelligence. We are all going to have a concierge on our phone who is going to speak to either our uh, Alexa, our Google, our uh, portal, whatever voice-activated operating system we choose to put in our house, and they are going to, that is all going to be driven by artificial intelligence. I'm going to do another video at probably this week where I'm going to explain to you how retail is going to change and how you're going to have an avatar that's going to do your shopping for you. And again, that will all be done through artificial intelligence. But the companies that are going to drive this, again, are Apple, Google, Amazon, Facebook. I'm going to add Samsung because I have a Samsung phone, Baidu, and Tencent. That's where we want to focus. That's what we want to concentrate. And again, let's share. Go to bestofusinvestors.com, register, become a part of the tribe, stop by the store, get your hat, get your coffee mug, and let's help each other grow our financial freedom. Thank you, Brandon.